Let's see if this worked as an impression mat or not. I just picked this up at the dollar store, this mat thing here. So if you could have a dollar giant or whatever it's called, it's a mat that you put in your sink for um, drying stuff. Drying dishes, sorry. Let's see what happened. I dusted it with Pretty Pretties. This is another rebatch. So my rebatch soap is pretty incredible, guys. Um, I had almost no shrinkage, which is completely new to me. Hmm, let's see if this is gonna come off. the first bit. Sparkle everywhere. It's not really. But the impression, oh my goodness. How pretty is that? I'd say that that's a definite win. Let's get my cutting board down here. Can you see all of that? Just make sure my lighting's not how pretty that is. I didn't do the ends because we're going to cut those anyway. And it's even pretty on the bottom. Okay. So hopefully, we're going to get a dramatic color splash inside. I hope. I hope, hope. That was my intention. It looks pretty muted now, which is still quite pretty. Let's see how big this needs to be. And I will be trimming up the top a little bit. Okay, so each bar needs to be about perfect. All right. Let's make sure that's tight and straight. Because I've cut a whole batch of soap crooked using that. <laughs> and this is going to be one of those end bars or special cut. Oh, yeah, baby. All right. It's exactly what I was going for for the inside. So we've got blue and we've got green and we've got this cream and then a silly kitty on his head with his feet in the air right there. How pretty is that? Super, super pretty. All right, we're going to line these up so you can see them. There we go. I think you can see them. Just make sure. So, you know what? Second thought, we're going to do it. I'm always trying to figure out how to Minimize the cutter and maximize the cut. <laughs> you want to see them cut, I'm sure. Oh yeah, I'm super ecstatic with this. I mean, it's so hard to work with the super thick medium. 
sometimes it can work to your advantage. These look like slabs of marble with sparkle on top. <laughs> and marble often does have a little sparkle. So this is one of my winter soap. Bit of that one, but not very much. There we go. Isn't that the cutest little kitty on his belly? So these are soft kitty Christmas kitty soap. <laughs> uh, yeah, influenced by a little bit by uh, popular culture. They just sleep get a big fat belly. Big fat belly. Big bang theory. <laughs> total, total fan. Bandom. Bandom soap, we'll call it that. Because I am, I am a total fan. Total science geek. Soapy science geek. It's a little bit too much. For that one. There we go. And it's funny, uh, no matter how smart you are, it seems like you have your moments of, what was that? Uh, didn't quite get that. <laughs> and one thing I've learned over the years is the more I learn, the less I truly know. <laughs> there is wisdom in that, believe me. I know you probably don't understand what I just said if you're young, but Basically, the more you learn, oops, the more questions you have, and the more seeking for answers you endeavor. And somehow, things are sticking to my gloves. Any kitty on his belly. I am loving these repatching soaps. I'm not gonna have any trouble at all unloading my uh, <laughs> my um, end pieces from my wholesale line. I'm just gonna do art bars with all of them from now on. Oh no, that's a little bit. I don't want to cut off his leg. Sleepy kitty. Soft kitty, sleepy kitty, little ball of fur. I've been wanting to do a kitty one for so long. These are all going to be different sizes. Because, <laughs> you know, I really suck at matching up. I need to mark better on my molds. So let's smoosh that a little bit. I love these little standing up kitties. Kind of reminded me of the cat came back or the cat returns. No, stu studio, excuse me, Studio Jilby ones. Maybe I'll definitely is a fandom soap. Either way. Love the tops, love the sides. I think I love everything about this soap. It's a smaller bar, but it's super, super cute. Just super, super cute. All right, so if you enjoyed this, click like and subscribe, and we'll see y'all next time. Bye for now.